Hey guys! I said some stuff and I was like, I don't know if I want to say that. So I just made a new video. That's all that I need to do. I have ink on my hand. I realized that when making the other one. I have ink all up on my hand. I, I just, I like to hold pens and I play with pens all day and I'm like a kid. So. Um. Anyway, I'm watching, uh, I don't even know what was, I don't know what I'm, of Community. I forgot what I was watching. <laughs> I was like, I don't even know now. I have no idea what I'm doing. Um, tired. If you can tell that. Tired. Um, might play some Five Nights at Freddy's really soon. Live on Facebook. But when you're seeing this, I probably will have not, or, or maybe will have, could have probably done it. So, you're, you've missed it. Or you didn't. You can go back and find it. Or not. Because I don't know if I'm going to. I don't know. I like my hair this way. I've decided this is like how I like my hair right now. Like, you know how I go through... I always go through like stages of like hair. Like, there's... I'll wear my hair a certain way for like, oh, like forever. And then I'll change it again. And I'll wear it like that for like ever. And then I'll change it back again. And I'll put it over the... <laughs> I'm, I'm constantly doing something. I don't know. Um, but I wanted to say this. I think this is okay for me to say. Um, this lady, she was really sad. And I knew something was wrong. I just knew. Like, it, I didn't know if it had anything to do with anything that happened while she was shopping or whatnot. But I knew something was wrong. And um, I, I'm not saying this story to make myself seem like a better person than anyone else or whatever. I'm just saying this for everyone out there. Sometimes somebody needs a hug. And this lady was really sad. And, you know, I asked her, you know, I hope she has a good day. And I hope things get better for her. And, like, she just she just stayed there for a second. She started to cry. And I, I walked around to give her a hug. And I said, you need a hug. And I'm like, I'm going to give you a hug. We're giving, I'm hugging you right now. Like, this is going to happen. Like, you need this. You need this hug. Um... And she just, she said, thank you, and because her cat had passed away because she had to put her down because she was too old. And I had to put my cat down, or she died, it died and put her down. She, um, she died herself, and, um, I know how that feels. And I know that sometimes you just need a hug. And, you know, that this is the problem with the world today is most people... In this situation, I don't know. They would have just been like, oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Well, you know, and it'd be awkward silence or something. And they would just be like, I hope this lady moves eventually. You know, but I wasn't going to do that. I would have talked to her for a while. I would have been like, hey, I need someone to come on my register. I need to talk to this customer. And I would have I would have talked to her for forever if she needed me to. Because um, sometimes people just need somebody. And maybe some people don't have anyone. And you might be the only person that person sees all day in their life. Like, even if you're out on the street and you're walking, this person, you can say hi to them. Or say, hey, how's it going? And if someone needs somebody, just go be there for them. Like, you don't need to be their friend. You don't even need to ever speak to them again. You don't need their number or their name. Just be there for someone. Sometimes people just need someone. You know, and I wish people would understand that. You don't need anything in return. You don't need to be like, oh, well, if I do this for this person, like, talk to them, then, then this, then, that, no. You can talk to people without needing anything in return. I'm going to open this. There's Lily. Hello. <laughs> you said it like it's a live thing. Whew! It's chocolate. Are they gluten-free? I don't actually know. But here it is. It's outside like <laughs> Let's see if it's gluten free. It doesn't say it isn't. You get water! Holy what? shit. Look at the, how many... 600 some calories. Look. Shit. Focus. Focus! Focus on it! It's not going to. 650 calories. I feel like the small one it is labeled. So I couldn't remember if they were a company that labels when it is or labels when it isn't. They normally label Hershey's does. I can look it up. 
I like Mr. Good Bars anyway. Anyway, this is, oh, yeah, no, it's the right way. There we go. It's a lot of calories. It's a lot of sugar probably up in there. I want one. Oh my God. You want one? One what? Yes. One piece? Yes. Not right now. But like when you open it. If I open ever. I might just leave it this way forever. I might hug you. She might. She is. <laughs> so, but, oh, don't, don't tickle me. Um, but yeah, the moral of the story is sometimes you need to sometimes give someone a nice. hug. Sometimes people just need hugs. And, you know, you should always ask. Like, you should never just go up and, like, randomly hug people because that's weird. But you should ask, like, do you need a hug? Do you need, like, and you'll just know. Sometimes you'll just know that person needs a freaking hug. And just give them a goddamn hug. Like, I don't understand why that's so hard for people. You need a hug. You're getting frustrated. Okay, now hug the camera. <laughs> no. But, yeah, so there you go. I did that, and I felt, like, really, I, and I told Delay, anytime she sees me, she needs a hug. She just needs a hug or someone to talk to. I'm, I'm right here. I'm right here. I will hug you. By the way, hashtag Queen of Cuddle. Did you just say? Yes. Hashtag Queen of Cuddles. Anyway, yes, so. And I know how to make a hashtag. <gasps> the pound symbol. It's a hashtag symbol. Hashtag Katie's awesome. Hashtag. Bye. Hashtag